As your baby is admitted to the neonatal intensive care unit, we know that this may be a very challenging time for you. The environment in the neonatal unit is highly specialised, stressful, and with our multidisciplinary team, we are here to support you in this journey. Imperial Neonatal Services are spread over two sites, Queen Charlotte's and Chelsea Hospital, where we have a level three neonatal intensive care unit, and St Mary's Hospital, which is a level two, now called local neonatal unit. Every year, more than 900 babies are admitted to our two neonatal units, making us one of the largest neonatal services in the UK. Our units provide care to high-risk, often critically ill neonates, and family integrated care is one of our guiding principles. The parent's role in their baby's care and development is vital. When a baby is in the womb, they are hearing their mother's voice and experiencing her being close through touch and smell. After they are born, this closeness remains very important. The feeling of being loved and cared for helps babies to feel secure and attached to their caregivers and respond better to stress. Being responsive to your baby's needs and providing them care and comfort helps with bonding. We understand and believe that even the best medical care cannot replace your presence and the love you can bring to your baby. In the Integrated Family Delivered Care Project, we are bringing parents in to become part of the neonatal care team where they are the primary caregivers to their baby. The aim of the Integrated Family Delivered Care Project is to work in partnership with parents to create a consistent and nurturing environment where parents are to feel engaged, enabled, educated and empowered as the primary caregiver to their baby. We believe parents can be the expert in their baby's care. In the Integrated Family Delivered Care Project, parents become primary caregivers to their baby. We achieve this through a competency-based parent education programme. This project and the mobile application were created with lots of thought, care and effort by our team and veteran parents to support you on your journey. If you want to participate in this care model, you can complete our competency-based training, which, once your baby is medically stable, enables you to become the primary caregiver of your baby for six to eight hours a day under the supervision of the neonatal team. You can also participate on the ward round and tell us about your baby's progress. Okay. So this is baby Lloyd. Um, she was born at 24 plus 5. Um, she's now 39 plus 3, corrected. Hello. We've just had a cuddle with Mummy. Now we've had our nappy changed twice. So we put in a new one. I suppose to be settling down to have a little sleep now. Yeah. Oh, really? 
Mm. Barnaby has other ideas. He's going to pull his laser from his heart. This app and education material was designed for our integrated family delivered care project. Even if you're not able to participate in this new care model, it can help you a lot on the way. We hope that with this material, we can help you to prepare and engage in this journey and understand what is happening to your baby. I'm Ian Lush, I'm Chief Executive of the Imperial College Healthcare Charity and we are supporting this project because the charity exists to help with projects that support patient experience and this is a very important project in helping parents to feel more confident about um, looking after their babies and to have more information and support. Now the charity isn't there to replace the funding that the hospitals get from the government, we're there to supplement that and that's why grants like this are so important in helping the hospital and its work. We feel that it is time to change the culture of how doctors, nurses and allied healthcare professionals interact with families and work together for the ultimate goal of a healthy child. I'm really looking forward to this project because this project will, will really bring a very different dimension to the neonatal care currently delivered in the United Kingdom.